yeah, I'm, uh, I'm happy with that. Uh, I think I've just got that finished just in time. Hello, how are we doing? <laughs> so, nice to have your company. It's me, Matthew Palmer. Uh, no, oh, no, it's not. Uh, there's, there's me. There's the name. I'm going to try and get away with that and pretend I'd spent hours, hours on, the, on that, but I haven't. The real professional, Matthew Palmer, is here on the studio, right on the other side, social distance from me there, with easel, ready to go. Matthew, a very warm welcome. Good evening. Hello, nice squirrel. Thank you very much. You've been said before. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad you appreciate it. I appreciate it. I love it. Thank you. Um, we have got the launch of a, another brand new one day special for you and it is brilliant that uh, you are now in the company of Matthew Palmer. Now, for those of you that uh, have followed Matthew before and seen Matthew's shows, you'll know what a fantastic artist and teacher that he is. And there'll be a lot of people, though, that we're watching for the first time as we, we find a lot of new viewers all the time flicking over and finding us, which is lovely. And if you are new to us at Achanda, a very warm welcome to you. Um, just tell us a little bit for those that uh, maybe aren't au fait with your backgrounds, but just a bit about how you got into art and actually what, what you can bring and show us here today, because we've got a brilliant one-day special for, for beginners, really. Right, right, OK. So I've been painting as long as I can remember. I started as a child, you know, very much a self-taught painter. So all the techniques I learned and I've been sort of teaching for all these years, 22 years next year I've been teaching, Have you? which is a long time. I started at Radio Engage. So all the techniques I, I teach is, is it's all stuff I've learned myself. Really? You know? OK. So the books, the DVDs, it's all about me and showing you techniques that makes it easy. That's the key. That's what we like. That's and, the key. And you are a fact, I mean, you're a brilliant, he's a brilliant, brilliant artist as testament to what you're seeing us around as well. But as far as teaching goes, you are in the best hands for that. And I can speak from experience. And I think I might have a little go in this hour as well. And we'll put that to the test again uh, with Matthew, which is absolutely brilliant. So if you want to see me uh, muck it up, oh, have a go, sorry, uh, please stay tuned as well for that one now let's just talk about the one day special yes. uh, because if you are thinking and uh, maybe you're starting uh, going into your uh, water coloring and you're just getting, picking up the bug maybe you've seen uh, maybe some of the shows in the past you want to have a go or someone you know has shown a punch on for it some sort of uh, looking into it in the future great Christmas present this is absolutely perfect for them with a brilliant I mean look at your one day special saving on this and when you see all the package that goes together that that saving you'll see is gonna be even more fantastical when you look at it, it is a brilliant with the book itself now this book um, Matthew that we're talking about here this is in the top 10 basically when it comes down from art yes uh, when you look at search press with regards to the quality that we get in here it is recognized as one of those best ones to go it for. is and this has been a number one bestseller on various places as well and it still is so it's a very popular one it was my first book and it's it's been out of stock for a while we have brought it back in stock it's been reprinted um, it's it's a belter folks and it is in the top 10 best-selling art and craft books of all time that's a huge thing for me obviously because I put a lot of work into this yeah of course. it's a book of two halves the first half of the book is very much all your watercolor companion all your essentials so what equipment you need what brushes you need you know how to mix colors you know, so the first half of the book is very much a watercolour field guide, let's call it this, because as you start to flick through the book, you'll see all the little tutorials and everything is step by step. How to sketch in things like how to sketch in flowers, people, boats. It starts off like that, how to convert photographs to p uh, paintings. But then it very quickly goes into the techniques, as you can see here, all, all step by step and all based around full colour illustrations and text. Loving Loads that. of colour mixing using primary colours as well. And it's a book that you can keep at the side of you, you know, keep it on yeah. your desk when you're working. If you think, well, how do you mix that colour? Get the book out, give it a go. How do you paint a tree? How do you do skies? You've got a, a big section here on skies. I you love this. There. Absolutely beautiful. And, and it's... it's it's published in Search Press's classic style, which is very much step by step. Right. Photographed in super high definition, if you like. Um, and just detailed beautifully, and it really is. And like you say, one of those books to have by the side, because, you know, uh, picking up some of these skills, these hints, these tips you talk about, you know, it's one of those, it's an ongoing process to sort of perfect. And it get is, better, yeah. Isn't it? Keep looking and it's over. such a... It's such a popular book, you know, it's been around such a long time now, and it really still sells extremely well. So why we brought it back, we've got it back printed again. But what we're seeing here is just the first half of the book, which yeah. is very much that companionship, you know, having these little mini tutorials how to do an autumn tree. But then when you get to halfway, you weirdly find some blank pages, and those blank pages are the, uh, the fold-out um, tracings for the tutorials in this 12 oh, this 12 brilliant. 
um, sketches. Six for complete beginners and six slightly more advanced advanced pictures, but you can sort of lead your way into them, okay? And every one of those 12 projects, which we'll see in a second, yeah. is very, very much step by step. I love this. So, I very mean, much you, step by step. So you can, you're, you're, you're going to have this to start off with. You pick it up, and once you've got those uh, hints and tips and those uh, techniques that you're going to see in the first half, then it's down to actually putting it into practice and having a go, it isn't is, it? It is, yes. Really? And all the techniques at the start of the book all come together for doing these paintings, okay? And there's 12 full step-by-step -step projects. Everything from a snow scene, to a beautiful lake scene, to mountains, to woodlands, to bluebells, to seascapes. It's a stunning book, folks, it really is. It really and is. It, it's everything I know about watercolour is in that book. So there's almost 30 years worth of my painting experience going into wow, this book. Wow, that is phenomenal. So just to, in, in a nutshell, again, if you, you'll find, you'll have the paperwork, you've got all the hints and tips in the first part, then you're going to actually have the paperwork that you can trace through and go for, for your 12 projects. Then, Village in Snow, for example, it, when he says step by step, you start off with step one, exactly what you go through, and then it will take you through all those double pages, all step by step, until you get to step to, uh, 39, until you've actually got your finished piece to sort of look at. So, you know, it really is, you're holding everyone's hands uh, all the way through the process. Absolutely, and what's also nice, Scott, around the studio where you're stood, there's four pictures. Yes. That's four of the paintings from the book. I thought it'd be nice to show you those. They are beautiful. So that's, there's the winter snow scene that we saw. Um, just coming into look at that beautiful that so is that is lovely. one of the pictures you get the sketch you get the colors all using primary colors off the shelf standard colors yeah nothing fancy here you know so it will just it's a great guide it really is you know this this scene coming up now is a late district scene as well that's beautiful that and incidentally this is one of the scenes that was actually also been filmed on the DVD that we also ah. given with the one day special filmed we on location in Keswick in the Lake District as well. Is it, do we have that? We've, we've got it, they've got it playing so you can actually see some go. of the footage because the DVD is part of the one day special. So that was shot actually in location again was, where we're going yeah. to be seeing this. It was a beautiful summer's evening actually. Um, lakeside in Keswick and we're talking about how to put the oh, sun on here. Beautiful. It's a 100 minute DVD and there's, there's two extra projects Oh, that you've okay. not got in the book. So if you sort of add it all together, you've got 14 big pictures in this one day That's special. That's brilliant. All step by step. That is absolutely fantastic. So you've got the DVD to go through, uh, which is phenomenal. Again, just carrying on that learning. And again, and some people, you know, if they are buying this as a present for somebody or you're treating yourself, we're allowed to do that this time of year. And after this year, we're definitely allowed to do that. To go through here, because some people will like the reading and taking that. You've got the visual there mm -hmm. with the images. And also then you've actually got the visual with a video or, or, or DVD to yeah. sit and watch it, to take it in those ways as well. So absolutely. whichever way people are preferring to learn, you've got it all covered for on those as well, which is great. Now, not only are you going to be getting your 12 projects and your beginner's step with your book, and you've got two extra projects as well in your DVD. You've got the paper, the tracing as well. You can see some of the images around here, but you're also going to start to give us some of the tools for the trade as well. Yes. So, three watercolour brushes, artist quality. We've got a large size 12 round brush, which is called a large all-rounder. That is good for doing your skies, um, your lakes, your, th uh, uh, your bluebells, and your big washes, your trees, that kind of thing. And that's a beautiful that's lovely, yeah. tipped brush manufactured by the SAA, so we know it's premium. Yeah. Um, and then we're also giving you that beautiful fine brush, which is called a rigger for detail, for doing branches, for doing fence posts. And then for me, the star of the show at the back there is a Matthew Palmer special brush called the tree and texture brush. If you rotate that to the side a little bit, you'll see the brushes on an angle. See that slight slope oh, at the top, yeah, like a deer foot, there, kind of yeah. thing, like a horse's hoof in a fashion. Yes. That's designed for stippling, okay? So we're giving you three brushes, the book and the DVD here, 14 projects in total, um, plus one of the projects from the book is also filmed on the DVD as well. So, so really there's 15 lessons plus hundreds of step-by-step -step tutorials in the first half of the book as well. It's a complete watercolour course 
All you want is your three primary colours and a bit of water, and you've cracked it. And that is it. You are good to go. Again, I, I can't stress enough the teaching that you... And you'll pick this up from Matthew as you go through the on the one-day specials anyway, but everything you hear and you see is all there in print or in DVD. £25.83 saving. Now, basically, you are looking at, basically, with the, with the, it's getting like your brushes for free in here with all this you're going to be getting near enough as an offer, which is phenomenal to start with. And I remember I had a go with that brush as well. Yeah. I was on with you last time, yeah, right. and we was doing a bit of the sort of the stippling around there on the on the sort of the bushes that was with it. It is fantastic. Uh, now, what a great idea! And I can tell you, people are already thinking this is a great idea. It's a gift idea. I don't mind whether it's for yourself or for someone that you think has always shown an interest. Almost twenty percent of the stock has already now been allocated. Ten minutes into the launch of the brand new one day special, eight five three zero double nine. Actually, uh, two of the brushes have sold out individually. Uh, actually, so if you want to go for them, uh, grab them. But individually, they are going very, very quickly. Is actually so uh, with regards to those as well. If you've got them in your baskets, please make sure you do have them checked out so you don't miss out on those. It's really absolutely fantastic. Those uh, well done. Um, now, we've actually got some of the other options uh, that you can add on to this. It's really uh, fantastic. Now, I've seen in here about masking fluid. I was looking through the book and it mentions masking yes. fluid. Just because it's part of this kit. Just tell us a little bit about how, the, how this works. Is it, is, it, is it easy to use? It is. So, masking fluid, um, for me, has always been an essential part of watercolours. It's, it's a liquid latex coloured solution, which you put on a painting, OK? Like the squirrel that we saw a few seconds ago, if you want to keep the snow on the branch white, the white is the paper. So you put this on first, you paint away and you peel it off. Right. And we're giving you a large bottle of masking fluid, uh, three special brushes that are designed for the application. And the reason they're special is because it doesn't stick to the hairs. You can pull it off oh, with your fingers. Okay. That's important. Right. Um, and there's a set of three there, super fine up to a large version as well. Rather than using nice quality, that's the wrong thing because these brushes are nice, but it's a different hair we're giving Got you. you. So Got rather you. than using premium sort of natural hair brushes to use masking fluid, it can stick to the bristle. Right. It can ruin a brush, whereas these brushes are designed for that reason. Perfect. So three brushes, large bottle of masking fluid, mm -hmm. and a wonderful, I've got to say this, the masking fluid marker pen. Now that is such a cool invention because it doesn't need brushes and it's a pen, basically. Um, that you draw masking fluid on with, and it's oh, okay. a lovely little invention that the SA has come up with. Um, it's a world first, in my opinion. That is a brilliant little tool, and that's included in that set, as well as the mask away, which is a yeah. less painful way of removing masking fluid. What I mean by that is you have to rub your finger on it, basically. <laughs> um, and if, if masking fluid has kind of gone off and lost its life a little bit, it can stick to the paper okay. a little bit. Okay. That will get it off. Oh, perfect. We've got all the tools for the job there. Absolutely perfect. Uh, now, this is a 22% saving that we're looking at here, down to 13.99, 383923. And again, if you are looking to sort of go those creations again, uh, I remember, I think the last time I was on the show with you, Matthew, you, you were doing a side of a, of a barn and you, and you used it there as well. And then That's when you right, sort of added did. the details onto yes, it. Um, it but it really, it does a lot of the work for you from what I can see, 383. 923, 13.99 only. Go for that. Almost a third of the stock already allocated there. So do grab that whilst you can. Uh, now then, we've also got more of the masking in here, but I've got a few other items in here. Again, is this a different style of, of adding our paint and working, or, or with regards to these? Yeah. So this, let's call this the watercolor special effects bundle. What we've got here is that same masking fluid, the same three brushes application, but then. We're giving you a beautiful large bottle of one of my favourite mediums to accompany watercolour, which is Schminky Aqua Shine. Now, this is gorgeous stuff. Um, it's a mica based um, medium, if you like. And actually, you've got a picture there back. Yeah, uh, I was going to try and show If you one. give that a bit of a wiggle, you'll kind of see the sparkle if the studio lights catch it. Hopefully, you it's can beautiful. catch them on the top. It's kind of in the sky. In the sky. In the snow, I yeah. can see it there. And, uh, we'll give it a wiggle. And you'll, you'll catch that it has a little sparkle about it. It looks like frosty. And yes, it does. It's beautiful stuff. I use it a lot. And we'll see that in action. Okay? There it is. We can see it there. And that bottle of... Yeah, look at that beautiful. And that bottle of aqua shine that we're giving you will last you for years it never goes off it doesn't ruin brushes because it's it's also contains gum arabic which of course is a natural water-based oh, ingredient I as see. well so it's a lovely little thing um and it's great i absolutely love it it's brilliant we're I also giving you um five palette knives now 
Palette knives you don't necessarily associate with watercolours, but I use them for scraping off, for doing trees, for doing rocks, for doing branches. These are plastic palette knives, which is better than the metal because it doesn't damage your paper. These oh, okay. are lovely tools. Nice. Right. Nice kit, that. Yeah, really nice, actually. A brilliant saving again. £5.40 saving on here. So under £20, actually. £18.49 pence only. Eight four three eight four five for those brand new on the show for you, that collection and that bundle. But really good. If you want to get that shimmer, uh, are, you, are you going to get a chance to work with any of that? Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll definitely we'll do his best. That. We'll do his best. We'll look at that. Yes. So you get a chance yes. to see how that works together, which is lovely. Uh, we've got one final masking bundle for you. Uh, the difference between set two here and set three that we've got here, Matthew? The difference is, is the Schminke, Schminke, bless you. Easy to say. Schminke, bless you. The Schminke <laughs> Aqua Modelling Paste, which is a medium that you can apply to any surface, whether it be glass or whether it be wood. It's, it, it's like a primer. But okay. when it dries, you can paint watercolour on it. So if you put it on, let's say, the side of a glass or something like this, let right, it dry, right. you can do a watercolour picture on a glass and it will give you that nice hand-painted feel. It's like a texture paste that you can mould 3D. Nice. It's a smooth texture, but it's basically a watercolour primer, Ooh, which is I'm very liking. nice. So we're going to go for some 3D effects on your watercolours. We are really pushing it out now. I'm loving this. Uh, 19.69 uh, that we're looking at here for you for your offer with that saving there that's in there. 341.879. Again, perfect opportunity if you go for these savings. Do take advantage of them. They are brilliant. Now. If you are, maybe I'm thinking if some people already started a bit more advanced as well, you know, with regards to their projects, they're going for it, and now you think, do you know what, you've been doing it a little while, maybe it's time to upgrade on the brush, because I'd imagine it's the same old saying that goes with this, Matthew, isn't it? You know, the whole thing of uh, you, you get what you pay for and everything, but also having the right tool yeah. for the right job. This is a lovely kit. If you know someone that is really into their painting now going for it, this is a lovely present for them. Yeah, exactly, and what you've just said there is you get what you pay for, but we are bringing you extremely high-end stuff. I've got to say and make it clear that... All the materials that we have on these shows are materials that I use myself as yeah. well, you know. That's everything from the paper, the fluid, these brushes, beautiful. Yeah. A set of five with a case. Now, you've got a large size 30 brush. Now, to put that in, in context, that is a mammoth brush. You know, it takes two batteries, not really. But that's a beautiful brush <laughs> for putting big washes on. It's stunning. And it works down to a size two. Wow. That's a great set of brushes you've got there. That Everything you want. Get that plus the one-day special. You've cracked it. That is phenomenal, actually. Now, if you take the case out of the equation, for this high-end quality, working at about £6.90, bear in mind that these are, you know, top of the end that you're looking at as well. £6.90 a brush if you take the, the, the actual case out of the equation. Now, of course, you've got the case included in here to keep them all beautifully uh, worked and to carry them around and work with. And you've got a lot more, as you can see. You've got all of those uh, extra areas there for more to add to your collection for it as well, So, which is absolutely brilliant. Uh, £34.49 and 49 pence only for all of those, which is phenomenal. 679585. Now, speaking of storage... With all those, uh, I think this is absolutely fantastic. I love uh, this box. You, you love it as we were talking about this earlier on. That's going to find its way into my uh, <laughs> into my van at the end of tomorrow. So Security check him on the way out. <laughs> it's, a, it's a wonderful box, these folks. It's a large wooden box. It really is beautiful. It's got these little handles that you can take the middle section out as well. It's great. I think that that's, is really it's, solid and well it's built. It's a that, super isn't it? box. Yeah, I love it. If I just tilt that, hopefully I can tilt that so you can see. All the different compartments actually aren't, aren't in there, so uh, just try and tilt it so the camera can get right in. But loads and loads of space, but beautifully put together. Uh, and I think if you are buying this as a treat for somebody else, uh, you know, to keep them all in there, that is going to last them a lifetime. That is so well made. Even the handle on the top there is all about the quality for this one. And I think that, for storage of any type, is fabulous at £29.99. It's got a whopping £16.50 off of that. 896841. Really lovely, solid, perfect as well, which is gorgeous. Now, the only thing you may want to add, if you're, if you're going to buy a bundle for somebody, if you're going to start them off, actually, you're going to give them the DVD, the one-day special, with the book as well, uh, and those brushes to go with. Uh, what you might want to just add on there as well, just to get them going, is maybe you pick a mix on the paints themselves there, which is what we've got for you here. Uh, now, I know that these are a lot of your very own special creations there and is. colours here. Yeah, Matthew. there is. So it's a mixture of some SAA colours and some Matthew Palmer colours. Um, so these are on the retail at £6.60, I want to say, per tube. So you get three for your £15.99. That's great. Uh, which is great value. The three colours I would go for here, folks, if you like foliage and... Uh, 
and um, of all seasons, I yeah. must say, go for the green, go for the orange, and go for the brown. That is what I would call the foliage set. Right. Natural brown for tree branches, green for summer trees, and orange for autumn. That's a lovely kit. And colours that you can't buy off the shelf as well, which is nice. Nice, absolutely. And really good values you heard from Matthew there as well. Uh, 679967, again, for that pick and mix of any three you wanted to go for as well for 1599, which is brilliant. Uh, the website, of course, is the place to go to so you can see the pick and mix. Choose which ones of those you want to. Add those into your basket for yourself or you might want to go for. Uh, might be going for the orange, as we heard about, the brown and the green as well. Uh, so you've got those options for all of your foliage to work through. Just add those into your basket and then you can uh, get all of those. Maybe you want to uh, open up a flexi order as well if you wanted to, to go for that and split that right the way across. And you might see a couple of add-ons in there that you might want to go to as well. We've got some more of the DVDs if you wanted to. Uh, so lots of options as well. Um, all the paint saver keys on there, Matthew. What am I going to do with it? Is that just literally to the end of the... Ah, uh, yeah. So if you're, if you're like me, which is a, a tight artist <laughs> then you want to get the last bit of paint out of that tube that's what you need oh nice oh, yeah. the perfect tool for tight artists uh, well uh, so uh, you so beautifully said uh, so beautifully said <laughs> um if you want to put those in then you can do of course now um i know that the uh, saa you're you're a member uh, yourself of the saa yes. for many many years i believe as um, well since i was 16 so that was about seven years ago well yes yeah. that's it. you do yeah, well so quite a long time well about that. <laughs> <laughs> talk to us a little bit about that because uh, to become a member membership on this one it's going to be it's full of goodies it is so I've been a member of this since I was about 16 bought for me as a gift from my parents still a member to this day working closely with these guys as well which is brilliant so I love the SAA great organization it's a organization for all artists this is your membership kit folks what you get is a year's membership 45 pound what you're going to get is a book on watercolours here, you're going to get a catalogue full of products from the SAA that you can order direct to your door, plus a membership only catalogue which has got big discounts, you get big discounts as a member, free shipping, that kind of thing. As being a member you get £5 to spend in the catalogue straight away because everything you spend you get loyalty points. But if you join the SAA now, there's much more than when I joined all those years ago because <laughs> what you get now is you get access to the massive online world of the SAA which includes a huge video on demand service, it's full to the rafters with step by step tutorials, there's quite a lot of me on there as well, lucky people. <laughs> don't know about that one. But there's quite a lot of me painting on there as well so there's loads of stuff for you as part of that membership. But here's the thing, if you join through um, Hachanda, yeah. via the link on the website, please don't click add to basket because that causes all sorts of problems, don't it? It does. So if you just basically scroll down past that, you'll see where it says click here for membership details. We will give you the year's membership plus, we'll give you some extras, we'll give you three watercolour paints, primary colours. Again, a beautiful um, addition to today's one day special mm, because those really are the colours that we use in the book and the DVD, so get those. We'll give you 10 sheets of watercolour paper as well. Great. Perfect for the one day special. And even better, we'll give you this wonderful TARDIS style carry bag that opens up four times its own body weight. Wow. So you can put all your little bits and pieces. Now, I think the combined value of all this together is well over 30 pounds worth of freebies, if not more, if I'm honest, but I'm just thinking in my head here. So it's a wonderful, um, membership deal. Yeah. Merry Christmas. Yeah, a really, a really good deal for that one. Again, so we'll just explain to you how to do that as well. So if you want to go into the website on achanda.com, uh, click on going through that uh, on the item itself. And as you go to that down the bottom, just below where it says description, you'll see there's a link that says click here for SAA membership. Just do exactly that. Click on there and that will take you right the way through for yourself. And then you can get that. I think that with the one day special, as you heard, Matthew became a member as well. It's one of those things that um, he's uh, he's still a member now uh, what he's bought for him for a present so who knows what you might unleash in those as well which is phenomenal uh, just to give an update by the way on the one day special we're almost a third of the one day special already allocated we're only 24 minutes in almost a third of the one day complete special for you here is already now pretty much allocated so i think it's time that we start getting that brush moving actually let's go then Come on. <laughs> yeah, no, oh i can't the if you can paint a squirrel you can paint anything that's <laughs> well, what we say that's, yeah. what, that's what they say. Want to Your turn later, is it? Yes, it right. So. so, what we'll do first, folks, is, is, is um, a little bit of sketching, a tiny bit of sketching. I want to sketch a robin. Christmas. We've got to do a festive scene. So, I've got a pencil here. This is just a normal pencil. This is a sheet of just a standard watercolour paper. 
you've probably got some of this again if you join the SAA you get some paper included and to sketch a robin it's quite a straightforward process what we do is we sketch in we'll do it just off center we'll sketch in a bit of a sort of egg shape let's say you know, see that it's very weak very faint but then just above we'll do another egg shape just here so there's two sort of very loose kind of circular shapes very faint and we'll connect it all together down the back and we'll turn we'll put the little sort of tail at the back there which of course is the wing can we see where we're going with this i think so i think break so. it into the little shapes now robins are quite chunky so we'll put a bit of meat on its bones we'll give it some weight around here there we go and then in the center somewhere of course we're going to pop in a little sort of triangular piece which is the first part of the beak now the actual claws and the detail that's something we'll add with the paint keep your sketch simple if you decide you want to sketch what i've got here folks is the masking fluid that is part of those additional bundles ah uh, yes yeah this is the blue mask i love the blue mask because you can see where you stick it and that's important in life so what we'll do is we'll get the masking fluid here and we're going to mask off some of the front of this bird here to keep it nice and clean against the background if that makes sense it keeps it nice and nice and fresh and white across the top as well i see so i'll pop that on then we'll just sketch in some little bits of snow that's going to be on a branch actually a snow covered branch here folks it'll be a nice kind of wintry scene we'll sketch this and of course it'll be a very quick version but again if you go for the one day special the tools are there for you to do these kind of paintings and yeah. just enjoy watercolours is what it's all about. Well, the, uh, the, the set that's got the masking fluid in there with the brushes and the uh, masking pen and the mask away block as well, already half the stock has already been allocated on that match as well, so it's proving really, really popular, actually. I can see why it's a lovely little set, that, that to be honest, it really is. Um, and everything from the SAA, by the way, is on extended delivery uh, the, from the 4th of December, so still plenty of time uh, we're looking at uh, for Christmas, of course. Only a couple of days. Yeah, not, not too long at all. Now, a very, very quick uh, blast with the dryer, then I'll get straight into the paintings. It'll take me a few seconds because masking fluid needs to dry. So I've just got a hair dry roll heat gun here. Just give it a very quick blast. That won't take long at all. I, I love it, that really lovely, simple way of just, of just how to sketch the, the robin itself. That's great. I think it's one of the first times we've done a sketch on a chandra, I think, mm. normally we just paint a picture, but I thought let's do something a bit yeah, different today. Yeah, that's great. It's lovely. Um, and because it's Christmas, of course, we can get away with doing anything, can't we? Yes, we can. Yeah, on the, on the old festive I love job. a festive scene. We've also got that beautiful aqua shine here as well. Can we see that down oh, there? Yes, this, this is, is the that, gorgeous aqua shine. Effect, yeah, now I want to use this with the paint and you'll see why it works okay. so well. Works perfect for winter scenes, but any time of year it puts sparkle on water. This comes with the masking fluid and it comes with those beautiful palette knives, I believe, yes, and yes, also yes. the applicator brushes. It's a great additional bundle, and that is a super price as well, folks. Yeah, just 18 49 You can pay that. £15 for a bottle of Aquashine. Just for that or just for the Just for Aquashine, yes. That is great. Absolutely. Value, so we'll take one of the three brushes from the One Day Special, and remember, just the brushes alone, you've pretty much covered the cost of the One Day Special here. Yeah. But we're giving you the book and, of course, the DVD. And we're, we're going to pop in some blue now this particular blue is called prussian blue okay prussian it's, yeah prussian it's basically a dark blue it's a lovely color and we're also going to take some natural orange which we'll pop just here as well all the colors i'm using are available in that pick and mix by the way so the orange and the prussian blue right we'll take a blob of aqua shine and we'll mix it within the prussian blue and we'll mix it within the orange. Now, of course, because I've got blue on the brush, it's going to go green, which is what we want to do anyway. Seriously. It's all planned. <laughs> it's all planned, this. I see. I Scripted, can see. is what I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he doesn't waver from it. <laughs> <laughs> now, back to the picture, folks. We'll use this large brush. Now, I've got to say that this size 12 brush is the perfect brush. It's called an all-rounder. Great for giving these large washers. So we'll put the water on. Now... This is um, watercolour paper that you might have purchased previously on some of the previous One Day Specials I've brought to Achanda. Um, so you've probably come across this paper. It's a lovely cotton paper where any good quality watercolour paper will work. Okay. So we'll wet the area. This is exciting, isn't it? And we'll <laughs> Once it's all nicely covered, like so, 
we're going to take some of the orange and we're going to sort of mix it into the background. Now remember this has got aqua shine. Now you'll see more of that once it starts to dry. Right. Okay. Straight into the Prussian blue, which is a, a much deeper, it's like a almost a midnight blue, great for the evening scenes, lovely for shadows on um, um, snow scenes. It's a lovely blue for reflections in water. It's a really nice colour. Getting plenty of it around that that sort of wintry branch that we've popped in down there. Yeah. Let the paint spread. Can you see how it's spreading out at the yeah, edges? I can see that sparkle already on the page. Yeah, if you give it a... Yeah, from where we You'll are, see it more is, when it dries. Quite... You'll see it more when it dries in and a few And that really was literally just a few tips of the, of the brush in there as well, wasn't it? You get a huge covering on that. Yeah. That's what you mean. I've got a bottle of Aquashine in my studio that I've had for about 10 years, and it's still got <laughs> some left in the bottom. It does go a long way, folks. It doesn't yeah. go off. It doesn't go off. So that's a lovely background. I made the colour a little bit stronger here. So I'm going to go a bit deeper with the Prussian blue. I'm just going to work it in. Let all the paint spread. Is that painting's falling, falling yeah, down the wall? Yeah, I don't think that painting wants to stay up there. Is that the Achanda spirit it's like again? We've now become haunted. <laughs> if other paintings start coming off, we're all right. It's been one of them days where, everything, where everything's been falling on the floor today. Perfect. OK. Now, what I'll do, folks, is I'll grab the... Um, Rigger brush again from the one day special. We can see it here, this beautiful kind of fine tipped brush. It's lovely for doing fine work, lovely for doing detail. And that's the perfect tool for um, branches, which is what I want to do We're here. Go to so, again, one of the colours from the pick and mix is natural brown, which, as I mentioned, is the perfect colour for twigs, branches, that kind of thing. And I'm going to paint underneath that masking fluid while the background is still damp. Right. Because what that'll do, Scott, is that'll give us like an out of focus kind of feel. Oh, I see. I don't know whether that makes sense or not. Can you see how it, yes. it spreads? Yeah. It bleeds into the background. It's what we call bleeding paint, which is quite a useful uh, saying from time to time. <laughs> we'll bring that in. I'm sure. I'm sure. And we'll bring that underneath here. Let well, it spread. While you're just doing that, I just want to let you know, we've had a, a picture being sent through... Um, Oh, now, this is from uh, oh, Sarah beautiful. that sent this through and uh, she started uh, basically uh, painting back in March this year. Okay. Uh, through the lockdown, she learned an awful lot, she says, through lockdown as well, from yourself, Matthew, and she sent that picture through that we've got on your screen. Oh, beautiful. Uh, so the that squirrel she... that you painted a, a little while Thank ago. Thank you. Yes, that's so, right. She's um, done a good job. Yeah. So, <laughs> well done, Sarah. Beautiful painting. Isn't that now, lovely? It's, it's stunning. Lots of people started painting through lockdown. It's been a very popular thing. Um, I've been teaching, as I mentioned, every time I come in, virtual workshops, um, which pretty much happen every uh, weekend. The one this week, uh, weekend is like a Christmas village, all step-by-step, -step, live on the internet, folks. Check it out on watercolour.tv. Right. Just a crafty plug there if you don't that. mind, get that I'm one in there. I'm liking that. I wonder if that's what Sarah's been doing, watching with you as well. But Yeah, I think she possibly has, actually. There's uh, people from all over the world taking part in those. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's is, really nice. wonderful. Well, Sarah, thank you for sharing that with us. If anybody else as well uh, uh, wants to share with that, please do so. But well done, Sarah. That really is lovely. And that's what I think, you know, when we think about the positives from lockdown, etc. you know, the things like to follow you and work with that, this is the time, isn't it, to pick those brushes up and have a go. If you've always wanted to have a go, I promise you, I absolutely loved it when I had my first go um, with, with one of the scenes we did when you was on last time, Matthew, and it was brilliant, it really was. And uh, I was actually showing my little girl, actually, we're doing some colouring, and we actually wet the paper first, and we just did oh, a little lovely. bit of the Beautiful. different colours. That's what it's about. It was, it's, it was lovely. It's an enjoyable thing. It's also escapism as well. Mm. There's a few things happening outside that we don't like, you know, yeah. so this takes you away from that a little bit, which is a good thing Yes, as well. it is, it is, it is. That um, wants to dry, but can we just quickly see, if I give that a wiggle, can we see the aqua shine? Yeah, you can around see that. Here? That can is a lovely effect. Can we see the sparkle there? It's absolutely stunning. See, that's already looking fabulous. You can always see how that's going to turn out. We're going to dry it, so it off, then we're going to paint in a robin. It's, that, is, that is looking fab, absolutely fab. But I tell you, while that is just drying off a second, we'll do a quick recap for you because it is proving really, really busy. Now, we are approaching 40%, basically, of everything you're looking at here. So when you think about that, we've got 
A lot of stock that's been brought in, of course, for this, for a one-day special. So we've got another live show again at 8, another one again tomorrow at 8, and at 12, and at 4. Now, 40% of that stock has already now been allocated, which is phenomenal. Uh, the individual book, uh, that sold out individually. The brushes individually, they've sold out individually already on the show. So I think there's a lot of people that are thinking, why not go for this as well? Now, when you think about, actually, the DVD on its own, uh, the DVD on its own is, what, £15.60, OK? That's the DVD at the bottom of your screen, 804912. Now, that DVD is almost £16 on its own, almost. So then you start adding in to what you're going to be getting with not just the DVD, but you get that fabulous book. It's a two-parter book, don't forget. That book, the first half of it is all your hints and tips, step-by-step -step guides for all of the sorts of skills that you'll need to pick up and to master as you go through with all your journey on it. The second half is about actually doing it. It's about all the projects, 12 of the, the 10 of the papers that are in there. The projects that you're looking at around me, there are four of those. So the papers that are inside are there for you to work with, to trace out. And then it is, I mean, one of them was like 30, 39 steps, not the film, 39 steps that will take you through how to then create one of these from scratch. And that is the same on each one of those 10 projects. There's also two projects, don't forget, in that DVD. So that's 12 projects step by step to take you through that you can master. Now, on top of that, you've seen already the quality of the brushes. They've gone uh, individually already. You're getting three of those fantastic brushes. You've got the large one you've just seen that's been worked with. You've also got the other one that's been seen there just working with the sort of branches and then you've got your sort of this stipply one that's going to bring you that that angled shape if I could tilt that around again and you'll see that because that's all part of the technique that uh, Matthew will teach you and talk you through but how to get those wonderful stippled effects on bushes and branches uh, and the trees that you're going to go through they're also included in that and for all of that there's also 25 pounds off which means you're getting all of that for 29 pounds and 99 pence now if you're just thinking what can I buy someone's going to start them off this could be the way to do it I I promise you. Or $29.99 to yourself, who knows how valuable that could turn out to be. 853-099. Listen, Sarah, she sent that lovely picture through the squirrel earlier on. She only started in March, and look at where she is already. So that could be you. Uh, Matthew, right. Yes. Nice and dry. Thank you very so much. we're going to use uh, one more product from the additional bundle, which is the mask away. Oh, yeah. So it's dry, so we can basically take this and we can remove that fluid and instantly. We'll see some oh, snow no, we see it. on the branches. Look at that, beautiful, isn't it? That is and beautiful. And then we'll take the fluid off the robin. It's kept him nice and fresh. But let's just have one more little quick look at the Aqua Shine around here, because can you see that lovely winter sparkle? Yeah. Now I use it all year round, not just for doing snow. It's it's nice for reflections on water. Mm, oh yes. Um, it's nice to get that sort of wet, rainy street effect as well. I've got some fluid up there as well, which is the, the snow coming down in the background. Oh. So already we've got a bit of a festive theme. Now let's quickly paint in a robin. Um, and we'll start off um, by actually, let's just actually talk about this brush. Now this one is the actual um, tree and texture brush that's included in your one day special. This one here is a stipple brush and it's designed for doing this. Now that's not something that you want to be doing with a nice size 12 brush because you'll ruin it. Look at the taper. A quick look at the palette. We can grab some of that brown that we just used here and we'll stipple it so it goes all beautifully spiky. We can see it. like how, how, how sort of separate this is. Yeah, like you having, can see it separated. Like having 30 brushes in one. And I can just put a few stipples around here. Just the last little bit of leaf. There's always a few leaves left on the trees, isn't there? But look how that gives individual leaves. It's lovely for that. And now the snow's come off. We can do this on the closer branches, which will give us that nice kind of... That's brilliant. ...in focus effect. But you imagine trying to get that randomness with a yeah. normal brush. You can't get it. These brushes have been tried and tested since about 1999. Have they? Very well-established brushes. So, with the size that. 10 brush, what we're going to do here is take the brown, which we've just been using, of course, um, for the branches, and then we can use this for the first part of the robin, and we'll take this colour... I'm going to work down the back here. So I've got a size 12 brush, but look at the point on it. And that's what's important. We can capture that detail from the robin just by bringing in, using the point of that brush. Bring it down here, all the way down to those tail feathers. It's like using a pen. It's lovely. It's, it's so a, tapered. It's a great tool, I must admit. And you can see just how sort of nice you can use the brush. Yeah. 
it's a lovely way of actually working. And it allows me to come down, we've got the wing here as well, bring the wing down. And then slightly underneath the, the belly, I'm calling it the belly probably, bring it down here. And that's the first part. Now if I clean that brush really well, I'll wipe off the excess on some kitchen paper. I never so lightly go into that colour and just lightly soften the edge because you see watercolour never really permanently dries. It's right. quite easy just to come back to it at any time and it allows you to go back in and you can smooth the paint over literally just with a damp brush. Perfect. Just a little bit more water there. Make sure that's all nice and all nice and smooth. Perfect. Then what we'll do is we'll add some red into the equation because obviously we've got a robin. Now if you look at a robin's breast, you'll see it's more of an orange than a red. But what we'll do is we'll work around the eye, of course. Get the eye in there. It's got red around there and the red goes right up to the beak. Bring that it detail. in. Detail, that, that, the way you can come in so close and all that, that is brilliant. Yeah, if you notice, I'm holding it like a pen. Yes, yeah. Bring it down here. Now it doesn't go all the way down, it just goes about halfway. And then you come back towards the brown, of course. And then you start to taper it off. Uh, if I clean the brush at that point, again, wipe the brush almost dry and then just give it a soften. Oh I, oh, I see, yeah. So you sort of fill it in and you get lighter tones and darker tones that way. Now obviously he's missing a beak and a, an eye, we'll get to that. This brown, if I mix it with some of the Prussian blue, it goes grey. And we, sp we talk about grey a lot in painting. It's, in, it's an important colour for shadow, so if you get a shadow underneath there, right, into the red, and then just use a bit of water on that brush just to taper it off into that white, so you get that nice little bit of a shadow. And I can continue this, I can make that colour thicker, the brown and the grey together, sorry, the brown and the blue together will make grey. That's Prussian blue and natural brown. It's a lovely dark colour, actually. Mm. And we can use this for adding the eye, of course, but also we've got to get that beak in as well, so the beak's going to go in there. I can't believe how fine you can go with those. This is the rigger brush, again, that's part of the one-day special. Yeah. We'll go around the eye, because there's, like, a nice dark area. A few shadows coming down here as well. And a beautiful shadow that goes under that wing as well. We need to get that in there. Now all that's going to get softened in a second, just by cleaning the brush, going back to the eye, smoothing it out. It's almost, we're painting, it's almost like an application and then you do the, sort of the blending. Yeah, see I'm conscious of time here, but obviously if you're working at home, you're working through the book, it's a bit more relaxed. Yeah. You don't have to be too precise about how you actually do these colours. But look how that's lifted the wing up. Yeah. And, of course, we can put some shadows for the tail feathers. And, of course, we can pop in the old, uh, the old um, feet here as well. Which, if you've done your research and watched Jurassic Park, you'll know that <laughs> they're a little bit scaly. All the films with dinosaurs in are also available, I imagine. Yeah, but that was a that. classic. But that's the better one, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just make sure that nicely blends in. I want to pop the eye in very shortly, but I just want to pop in a few little areas of, of, of sort of shadow. Oh, it's lovely, this. Is it looking like a bird? It is. Not yeah. an aeroplane? No. Or Superman? You've captured the idea of that falcon beautifully there. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful bearded chuff. <laughs> exactly what you were going for. Just going to pop a few little lines down the back here. It's quite addictive once you start and you totally switch off from yeah. the fact that there's at least four people watching his live on agenda. It's <laughs> I'm uh, watching, uh, the, but everyone else in this has gone, oh, just... But that's what, that's what this is all about, isn't it? And it's, um, it's the process, it's not the rushing. I was speaking to one of the guests last night, we were doing some cross-stitching, and, uh, and she was talking about, you know, it's take, don't, don't feel like you have to rush it. There's no set time when you've got to have it completed by. You know, it's the, the whole process is to enjoy the journey and forget about the deadline of when you've got to have it done by. Actually yeah. enjoy whilst you're actually carrying out the activity. And I think sometimes people obviously watch these shows and think, oh, you know, you've got to 
work at this pace, but you haven't, you've just got to enjoy the process yeah. and just painting the bird and just, just kind of get it all flowing. And of course, you can just kind of, just to finish off very briefly, it's going to be a very, very quick uh, dry here and pop a little bit of light in, but that'll take me a second to do that. No worries. This hour's gone fast. That's, that's nice and dry. Now, just hanging around in the back here, we've got a craft knife, which is a sharp, just a sharp knife. And I'm just going to pop in some, some light, scrape off some colour in the wing, give texture. Pop a little bit of light around here as well, around the head, around the eye. And even you can scrape in some extra branches look as well. Mm. So you can actually scrape off with a knife. <laughs> That's a great effect, that. It just gives it a little bit of extra Christmas, don't it? And it's, just makes uh, it look yeah. a little bit more, a little bit more effective. And it's a nice way of just adding a little bit of extra light into it. And even putting extra little bits of falling snow on as well by scraping off colour. But I think for a quick picture, I think that is a perfectly acceptable, is quirky little robin with a lovely bit of aqua shine, of course. Don't forget the beautiful aqua shine is in there as well, which gives that beautiful little bit of I texture. just think that is fantastic. I love that. Absolutely love that, Matthew. Thank you very much for sharing that with us. Uh, that's got to have wet your whistle, hasn't it? You know, we've got to be thinking about it. I mean, there's a lot of people now. It's very, 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 very busy. Almost 40%, as I said, uh, gone. And I tell you what, one of these, when people are watching Matthew, because it's almost like a lesson, and honestly, when you go through the DVD, when it takes you step by step, you will completely get lost in this. And the pride that you get from whatever it is you create when you start through, this is absolutely absolutely brilliant brilliant way to have a little go at this to start off with and for 29 pounds or ni and 99 pence you've got that 25 pound saving here you know we're, we're, we're doing a brilliant offer uh, that I promise you once you've started who knows what this could be the beginning of you've got that book as I said don't forget that book the half first half is all about step by step on all sorts so there's exercises in there to be carrying out how to do your painting of your figures uh, it will talk you through uh, wet into wet reflections we're talking about all those wonderful ideas and um, when you're painting water uh, for example the trees the tree section the whole section on trees you've got the autumn trees to work with the spring trees all the how to get those colors and all of those um, and the whole section just in those trees skies uh, how to mix your colors when you watercolor techniques so the first half is all about those techniques to work with the second half is all about projects to actually do 10 projects for you to actually do. You've got four of them that are around me at the moment, actually, so you can start to look at. So that's the book. You get the DVD and you get those three brushes and all of that for £29.99. 853099 is the one per one to go for. Now, don't forget, the SAA membership is also available for you, and I think that is a great opportunity. If you want to go onto the website, you click on the link uh, on that one just below uh, where you actually see the details come up on the website, and that, for £45, uh, 127400 if you follow that one please only follow the link and click on the link uh, but that has got so many goodies in there for you and lots of online support and to help as well so you'll be part of a community that is all trying and doing and excelling in everything that you are doing as well uh, so a perfect gift and a great addition to the one day special as well so why not have be a student? Why not put yourself on live TV and be a student? If you don't have to do that, you can do yours from home. But I have to do it here in front of you with the whole class watching. So, sir, what are we doing today in arts? We're going to paint a tree. Um, a tree. A winter tree, folks. So if you've got some watercolours, paint along at home as well. <sighs> We've got a sheet of watercolour paper here, well, just stuck to a board. And hanging around your um, desk, this got hopefully is the the fine brush, the rigger brush, the size two rigger brush, the beautiful pointy tipped one. Yes. So if you give it a rinse in the water. Yep. And in your palette, you've got that nice natural brown colour that we spoke about. Can you see the brown? Uh, the colours look very yeah. dark when you see them concentrated. But what happens is the paint kind of. When you put water, that shows the quality of these colours because water brings the colour out. Yeah. Oh, God, so yeah. if you just take a blob of the brown and a bit of water yeah. and sort of mix it around, I know you can't really see much. Oh, there you go, you can see the palette now. Mix it around. We're at a good safe distance here, aren't we? If you we shout are loud very enough, safe. We can, can you pass the salt, please? <laughs> now, what, what we'll do is we'll basically take this rigger brush. Okay, now if you want to watch me first. I'm trying. Think about how you can hold the brush. If you. If you use it as a pen, you'd hold it there, yeah? Yeah. If you pull it back a little bit, you can almost lay the brush flat to the paper 
and drag it up and gradually make it go thinner and thinner by gradually lifting it off. So eventually you get to that fine... Does that make sense? Okay, if you do that you first, that's the, the way OK, OK, OK. You sort of lay the brush flat with the brown on and then just draw it up the paper. So I think you might have used orange there. Oh, is that orange? Is it? What's the brown one, then? <laughs> I've, got, I've gone with an orange. OK, well, <laughs> you can't beat a good orange <laughs> no, tree. That's what I thought, a nice orange tree. Where's the brown on there, otherwise? That's red, that's blue, that's You can yellow. change the colour that's if you good. like. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it might be the really dark one. Is it the black one there or that green? Yeah, that might be the one. So, OK, so I start so, again with a bit of that on the yeah, top. Yeah, go for it. Yeah, I'm going to go with yeah. the ones. This is no. why, this is what it's all fun, isn't it? I'll yeah, go good. for that. I'll go for... Is that blue? That's blue. Right, hang on. First thing is, don't watch in black and white. <laughs> that's the first lesson. Is that... Right, that's... Yes! Yes! There you go. And that concludes lesson one. Right, <laughs> OK, so can I go over so, the bit? I've just done yeah, that Yeah, you bit. go for it, yes. Yeah, a little bit of water. Yeah. And then just sort of paint that branch, and then you sort of do that one long stroke, and then you... St you literally branch out, but you've got to think a tree goes from thick to thin. OK? Ooh, so... It's... If it's a bit dry, put a bit more water on your brush, mix it in the colour, and then just, just take it up the paper and gradually lift it off, and it gets thinner, and eventually it'll hold it. Look at that, perfect. And then if you do one on the other side, literally branching out like this, can you see? Gradually take it off to a point. So you've got your second branch, and then you just add some fine ones. Well, that's when you use the brush like a pencil or a pen, and... It just goes to show how nice this brush is because it's got such a lovely point on it. Oh. Now, a good tip here, Scott, is if you're left or right-handed, rotate the board to make it more comfortable for you. OK? Because people rotate do... Rotate the board? OK. Because it's always important that you paint a, tr a tree in the way it grows, you know, away from itself. So That's if I was to rotate the board this way, for example, that would make it I've got quite a splurge. Easy. Oh, mine. I think mine's more of a... That'd make it easy for doing these branches on this <laughs> side, you see. I'll still be here, by the way, when we start to do a live show again, back again at, uh, at 8 o'clock. That's all right. Absolutely. Look at that. <laughs> so that's how, you, that's how you paint a simple sort of winter tree. And you keep adding lots and lots of fine branches to it, which is very good. Oh, how are wow. we doing? How are we looking? Oh, I see what you mean, but yeah, OK. So okay. if you paint the branch towards you, but literally... Hold the metal bit, yeah, and rest on your paper like you, like you're writing, like that, yeah, and just use the tip of the brush, and you get more control out of it then. Perfect. Well, they are quite wispy at the end, aren't they? They are. They just... They're very fine. A traditional rigger brush is not like that, but this is called a liner brush. It's got a very fine tip on it. Beautiful. We've only got three minutes, so I'm okay. going to be here for the next five. What we'll do is we'll finish off in a second by putting a few leaves on the tree, OK? OK, OK. And you, you can do that now or you can do that in a few seconds. Oh, oh, oh I'm more than happy. OK, I, I've got, I can always cut you. Uh, you, you go with the tree and I'll, okay, I'll, great I'll, stuff. I'll leave. I'll just so finish off my branch. We've got the uh, tree and texture brush again in, in the one-day special. It's included, yeah? So we'll clean that in the water. And what we'll do is we'll shake off the excess water on the on the side. And if you want to do the autumn tree like you discovered the orange there, Scott, you can go have for you, the orange. Yeah, have you found that orange, yeah. And we can mix the orange into the brush, like so. And we can give it a good old stipple. And then, of course, back to the picture, and you can do some of this. You need some lovely autumnal leaf, which is a lovely way of working. Oh, now, I if like you that. are using uh, primary colours, you can mix an orange, of course, from yellow and red. But that's a lovely way to do a nice kind of autumnal tree. Now, if you want to add a bit more tone to the tree, of course, you can pick up some of the brown and mix the brown with the orange, and that'll give you a darker version, as you can see there. So it's allowing you to get a bit more creativity from your trees. But this brush is included in the one-day special. Oh, I as love well that. As the, as I well. will... I've only got about a minute left. OK, great. Well, you should so try I don't want to rush me stippling. You should try and put some leaf on, then. OK. I'll leave mine alone. So do I wet... Do, I, do, I, do you say I wet, wet the brush first or not? Yeah. So clean the brush and sort of shake it on the side of the... What looks like an ashtray to me, but I'm yeah. not sure. Yeah, it does and a then, bit, doesn't yeah, it? And then kind of shape off, shake off the excess water. Yeah. And then get a big thick blob of the orange. Straight into the actual paint Straight itself. in. Mix it round in your mixing area. Got 45 seconds. You know what? 
you can do this. Do you know you what I'm going to do? You can smell the fear. I Mix it around. Yeah. And give it a good stipple, squash your brush. And okay. then move onto your paper and just do gentle little taps with the tip of that brush. Towards the end of them? Yeah. Now, if it's a bit dry, you can pop a little bit of water on your brush. Right. I'll tell you what, everybody. Uh, you have to come back again at, at 8 o'clock and, and see... That's working nice, though. Uh, ..this masterpiece, <laughs> how, it, how it comes on. Um, but I can tell you, if you have half as much fun as I've had in the last eight minutes, you're going to love it. Uh, please come back and join us. Matthew, thank you so thank much you. for this one. Thank you. 40% is already gone. Make sure you're back at 8 for